You owe me a job. What? I'm not speaking Greek. Marvel's The Fantastic Four has made a major casting announcement for The Silver Surfer. Join us on Screen Rant as we break it down. It's been 17 years since we've seen The Silver Surfer on the big screen when Doug Jones portrayed him in The Fantastic Four Rise of The Silver Surfer. This is the end for us both. The film made $302 million worldwide, but was a critical failure, garnering just a 38% Rotten Tomato score, mostly putting an end to the franchise, apart from a 2015 reboot that bombed. Those films were produced by 20th Century Fox. In 2019, Disney acquired the company and thus the rights to the franchise, setting the stage for 2025's reboot. Casting is underway for the film, with Vanessa Kirby and Pedro Pascal already on board as Sue Storm. Storm and Reed Richards. Now Marvel has announced the Silver Surfer will be portrayed by Julia Garner of Ozarks fame. You gotta be kidding me. If I was kidding, I would have said you're witty and handsome. This version of the Surfer will be Shala Ball, a character who is Silver Surfer's love interest in the Marvel comics. This is a change of pace from what many might have expected, given Nurin Rad is the more traditional choice for the Silver Surfer. Shala Ball has also been the Silver Surfer before in the alternate reality of Marvel's Earth 9997. In this universe, Franklin Richards becomes a new version of Galactus and gives Shala Ball the same powers as Nurin Rad, so they can both be Silver Surfers together. Due to the the galactic logistics involved in the storytelling, it seems likely that the Shalabal Silver Surfer in the MCU will be closer to Norrin Rad's typical character. Julia Garner is perhaps best known for her role as Ruth in the Netflix series Ozark. The actress is also set to appear in Universal's upcoming Wolfman reboot, which will release the same year as Fantastic Four. That's all for now. We'll be looking forward to seeing Garner's depiction of the Silver Surfer, and we'll have all the latest casting updates on Screen Rant.